Armed forces hit a Russian howitzer on the territory of the Russian Federation. Ukrainian artillerymen struck the Russian positions in the territory of the Belgorod region and destroyed the howitzer. The video of the defeat of the Russian artillery was made public on the network. On May 23rd, during a reconnaissance flight, the Aerial Reconnaissance Unit of the 15th Separate Artillery Reconnaissance Brigade detected a Russian 2A-65 Mstabi howitzer 7 kilometers from the border with Ukraine. The video recorded how the unit's gunners struck with an unknown type of high-precision weapon, hitting the Russian artillery installation with the first shot. The footage shows how the ammunition detonates and burns after the impact not far from the affected howitzer. The Russian army only recently began to deploy additional units of personnel troops on the northern border with Ukraine. This is related to the recent raids of the Russian Volunteer Corps on the territory of the Belgorod and Bryansk regions of the Russian Federation. The position of the Russian howitzer is geolocated, it was, here, near the village of Serkovo. It is approximately 7 kilometers from the border with Ukraine. It is not known for certain what means were used to strike the Russian positions. According to Open Data, the 14th Artillery Reconnaissance Brigade is armed with 300mm 9K58 Smirch multiple rocket systems, but the nature of the damage makes it clear that it is not them. Currently, the armed forces have a large shortage of 300mm rockets, they are not manufactured in Ukraine and they are not distributed on the world arms market. De facto, the Ukrainian military no longer uses these systems. Considering the latter, it can be assumed that the artillery division of this brigade was gradually rearmed with long-range models of Western-style anti-aircraft missiles, such as HIMARS or M270.